Hello viewers and welcome to Two Ways One Couples. This is a show where we discuss matters marriage and of course we've been having couples we've been tracking for a while now taking the principles and implementing them in their lives and of course today we are going to discuss different issues that have come up with in our previous shows and with me in studio we have guests a couple power couple that has been tracking that has taken the word and been married for five years I think it sounds like they have been married for 10 years. They have reversed time. I think this is what is called restoration of time because of taking the word of God and putting it in their marriage and they are experiencing the fruits of it. We want to hear from our guests. Let them introduce themselves. I'm Eric Mulati and this is... I'm Zilani Mulati. <laughs> These are the Mulattis. Yes. Of course, new uh, parents mm -hmm. with a daughter four months now. Mm -hmm. And uh, I believe... In your five years mm. of marriage, you have uh, something to tell us. Yes. Mm. We don't take it for granted yes. that mm. five years of marriage, mm. you've rubbed each other mm. and you've learned something. Of <laughs> course, with me in studio <laughs> is my very own <laughs> Charles of Pio. Yes, good to be here as usual. Yes, <laughs> yes two as one couples and uh, my name is Susan Opio and we... Look forward to see what you have for us as yeah. our guest today. Yes. So uh -huh. this time yes. we break protocol yes. and we said let's start with Zilani. Yes. Uh -huh. <laughs> okay. Okay. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. So uh, first we are so honored to be here and so delighted uh, because the things we are learning are just amazing. Mm. And so for us, I think one of the things that has really stood out for me is uh, the issue of submission. I won't talk so much about his side eh? mm -hmm. because <laughs> he knows what he had. Yes. But uh, just to see that, uh, you know, submission is not su subjugation. Mm -hmm. um, where we are coming from, we come from areas of culture whereby the man is so strong and he wants to put down the woman. Mm -hmm. But now here in the kingdom environment, you know, we are being told, God is actually saying, you woman, you're so, you're so powerful, yeah. such that now I want that power for you to bring it under the authority of the man. Mm -hmm. And so for me, I've, I've, I've really flipped the switch when it comes to submission. Yes. And, um, say, and I come from a point of, you know what, it's not being belittled, mm -hmm. but it's really supporting my husband, supporting now Eric, mm -hmm. based on the assignment that God has given us. Mm -hmm. And, and now that you're talking about the assignment mm -hmm. on the same, for me, you know, I got through the discussion that's been going on. I got, you know, husband love. Mm -hmm. Now, there's an, I, I got the revelation of what the word husband means, which means, you know, one with assignment, mm -hmm. one connected to God, and, uh, you know, one who's able to bring the wife to, to see God. And so our assignment, mm -hmm. you know, has to be clear so that, she submits to help me mm. to achieve the assignment so that so, we are one. Yes. So what I'm hearing is she is submitting, yes. but not to Eric, yes. mm. but to the assignment of God in Eric. Yes. Mm -hmm. So that, of course, we always say there's no, you're going to discuss the assignment or we're not going to discuss submission mm -hmm. without discussing the man. There's yes. no, we can isolate the two. Yes. Remember, they are yes. one. Yes. Mm -hmm. We don't want to be asunder. We are saying, let's discuss submission but you cannot discuss submission mm -hmm. without discussing yes. the assignment yes. because what are we submitting yes. to yes. and maybe as yes. we are continuing yes. with this mm -hmm. we need to just mention something about the assignment that mm -hmm. a woman submits to yes mm -hmm. and again the whole story begins with a picture of of um what god has joined together yes and uh, in one of the cities we spoke about joining meaning yoked yes and the principle of two oxen mm -hmm. yoked together yes so the principle is why are they yoked together so they can plow Mm. There is mm. something they are doing mm. that is why they were yoked. Mm. Mm. And I think when we reference that, it changes the whole dynamic of marriage. Mm. Mm. It creates the idea that marriage is here more for the assignment than for us. Mm. Mm. In fact, we are here for because there is an assignment. Because there is an assignment, yes. Now, submitting is no longer to the person. And let me talk so about something about yoked and leadership. Yes. Think of the oxen when they are yoked together. Mm -hmm. And if they are put together, leadership there doesn't mean the one who goes ahead. Mm. Mm. It doesn't mean the one who pulls you or points out. We've always used leadership from a secular fallen environment. Mm. Mm. From a fallen environment, leadership is the one who goes ahead and others follow. Yeah. In the kingdom, leadership is not the one who goes ahead. Leadership is the one who knows the way. Mm. Mm. 
<laughs> that's different. That's a different no. way to look at it. Yeah. 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 The one who knows uh -huh. our way can change who goes ahead. Uh -huh. Mm. Mm. Uh -huh. Anyone can go ahead. Yeah. But under the instruction of the one who knows, who knows the, way. the way. So it means that when these two are yoked together, mm. it means that I'm yoked to her. But as we are yoked, I say, let's go left. But if you watch us moving, you will see seamlessness. Yeah. Yes. We are in mm. sync. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So it's not that I am the one who went, then she has to follow. Yes. There's no gap in our movement. Mm. But I am able to say, mm. let's go right, let's go left. Mm -hmm. It's the same way you look at a body moving. You can't tell the brain is talking. Mm -hmm. Yes. So maybe in, in line with what you're saying, Yes. are you saying that's in line with oneness? Yes. Uh -huh. that's Complete oneness. oneness. Mm. Yeah. And the picture is this. That's what we mean by submission. Mm. Only submitting to. Mm. 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 Not submitting to me. Mm -hmm. She's not submitting to me. Mm -hmm. She's submitting to what I said left. Mm. And that mm. is a word mm. again from God. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Which yeah. again takes us yes. back to First Corinthians 11. Mm. The head of yes. man is Christ. Mm. The head of Christ is God. Yes. Meaning when the man is saying left, mm. he's actually hearing who? From Christ, mm -hmm. exactly. from God. And when the woman is turning left, as, uh, and here yes. we have the picture of oxen, yeah. this is God moving in the it's earth. God moving. You know? Wow. Yes. I mean, it's such an easy way to understand. Mm -hmm. If you look at creation and you say, when you look at creation, you get principles mm -hmm. of how to live. Mm -hmm. Because when you look at oxen, you find principles that are so easy to understand. You, are, you have to be a genius to mm -hmm. miss it. Mm -hmm. That you cannot yoke two oxen that are of different size. Mm -hmm. That already tells us, as a couple, equality is not something we fight for. It's yes. not something I protest mm -hmm. it's not something that i come with placards mm -hmm. yes. this is where we are equal mm -hmm. you know and again when you talk of power mm -hmm. there's no way i'm going to be yoked to my husband is if he's more powerful than me yes. so that again removes issues of yeah. power mm -hmm. it removes issues of uh, subjugation like mm -hmm. you're saying mm -hmm. so my submission doesn't make me lesser it's no. actually an acknowledgement of the power i have yes. and that is why i'm submitting yes. now eric maybe you can talk about when you she talks of submission yes. so and she's I, submitting to you. Yes, mm -hmm. so when she talks about submission for mm -hmm. me, mm -hmm. I need to sh to love her. Mm -hmm. And, uh, you know, you shared, and that really opened up a lot of things for me in terms of agape, love. Yeah. And so that's the dimension in which I need to function. So agape for me is I need to, to, to relate with God, mm -hmm. love God, mm -hmm. and that level of love that's what I'm supposed to, you know, extend to her. And there are different dynamics mm. which you shared. You know, there's filio, there is uh, stroge, yeah. stroge, and there is uh, eros. 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 Yeah. So when I operate in the dimension of agape, th because I'm connected to the Father, mm. and I'm able to, to, to you know, be patient, mm -hmm. to be kind, to no, not keep record of wrong mm. to support her, then she automatically responds and submission mm. becomes her mm. natural response So to submission my love. is not something yeah. demanded. Yes. Actually, I can add on that. Mm -hmm. When he's kind and he's really being good, eh, which mm. is a reflection of the father, mm. somehow it melts my heart. Mm. And I'm like, you know what? Let me let me submit. Yes. Let me go that extra mile. Mm. Probably, maybe I'm, I'm, I'm a little bit tired with Bree. Yes. I've done this, 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 and he comes home. And I am like, you know what? I'm so exhausted, but I will serve my husband. Mm. I will go that extra mile mm. to just make him also okay. So submission yeah. becomes um, something you do with joy. Mm -hmm. Exactly. It's no longer what culture mm. yes. uh, defines. Mm -hmm. Yes. So, yeah. I can take the same illustration again. Mm -hmm. yeah. See, I, I'm staying with this prop mm -hmm. called the oxen. Mm -hmm. oh, yes. And there's a reason I'm using it a lot. Yeah. Think of it this way, mm -hmm. that now as the husband, as the leader, we both have this. Mm -hmm. How do I love her? Mm -hmm. Okay? We are carrying this mm -hmm. weight. Mm -hmm. We are moving. Mm -hmm. This is the thing. Mm -hmm. I look and I can see she's under strain and I tell her, you'll be okay. Mm -hmm. We can carry this. Mm -hmm. We can manage this. Mm -hmm. In fact, let me tell you how. Mm -hmm. Lift your leg a bit. Are you okay? Mm. Yes. Just put it out. Mm. See what will happen next. Mm. There you go. Mm. See it worked. Mm -hmm. Now put the other one. Mm. Let it go. Mm. So that's the one picture. Mm. That's the, the agape side. Yes. The agape side that says, it's okay. By the way, I'm not moving unless you're moving. Mm. We are together mm. in this. I'm not leaving you behind. Mm. Wow. Don't worry. You're yeah. capable of this. Mm. You can carry this. I know your strength. Mm. I know your ability. Mm. Trust me, we can do this. Oh, yes. And without you, I can't move. Mm. I'm waiting for you. Yeah. Now the fact that I'm waiting for you, 
also makes you realize you care. Mm. You're not just trying to go. Mm. You're not trying to show how weak I am. Mm. You're not pointing out how badly I'm doing. Mm. I'm not saying, mm. look at you. Look at where you've kept us mm. now. Mm. See, we can't even move. Mm. We would have been so far now mm. if it wasn't for you. Mm. It's a real shift. Mm. It is, uh uh listen to me. This is where we are. Mm. Now, why does God bring the other three? Like I said, are the other three fit into this? Mm. God is not wicked. Mm. God wants you to enjoy that burden you're carrying. Uh -huh. In that enjoyment comes filio. Mm. Mm. Why does filio come in that enjoyment? Mm. So that we can laugh and be happy mm. 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 in the process. Mm. Yeah. The same God wants us to have storage, which is commitment, mm -hmm. caring yeah. for one another mm. in the same burden, mm. eros, intimacy, yeah. so that you, 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 you enjoy each other's company while carrying. Ladies, submission is not hard after all. Mm. It's only hard when you're outside the garden. Mm. It's only hard mm. when you're operating outside of your father, God. Mm. It's only difficult when you are already outside yes. the garden of where God placed you. Yes. So how do we get this back? Mm. Come back to the garden. Mm. And of course, when you talk about coming back to the garden, the first thing mm. is come back to the father. Yes. What about... Uh, love when you talk of love like you're mm -hmm. saying yeah. we talk of love and the men are like how yeah. do we love mm -hmm. how do i love this woman mm -hmm. why mm -hmm. because you're asking outside of the garden yeah. so when it comes to loving we are also saying listen you're expressing god to your mm -hmm. wife you're expressing god in your life mm -hmm. and as you do that it changes you mm -hmm. as you do it mm -hmm. i think uh, okay and, Eric, and, maybe? And, and you know in fact we we also learned you know through the show that mm -hmm. you know god is love and we were made in God's image. image. image yeah. And so it means mm. even our DNA mm. is love. love. Yeah. And so we need to function in that dimension. So yeah. and and in Corinthians, you know, it's clearly stipulated mm. what love is. It's you know, it's more of not self but more of otherness. selfless, mm. yeah. Mm. Otherness, yeah. selflessness. Mm -hmm. So I, by me loving her, it means like Charles was saying, you know, I'm more patient with her. Mm. I'm more kind. Uh, mm -hmm. You know, I'm always there, you know, to encourage her mm -hmm. to and to show her that we're in this together. And, yes. and that's how now we function rather than operating from a point of feelings, mm. you know, to operating from a point of mm -hmm. it's a decision and a commitment I've made yeah. to walk this journey. Mm -hmm. yeah. yeah, and I think um, even as he talks about love, I can also add something in terms of uh, submission. Mm. You know, sometimes we are having a discussion and there's something maybe God has told us to do and he has his frame of thought. I have my frame of thought mm. and maybe he'll tell me something and I'm like, no, that one won't work. Mm. I know for sure it won't work, yeah. but he's very sure mm. he knows it will work. Mm. So I've learned to come to a point of saying, you know what? He's the, he's my, he's the head, he's the authority. Yes. Let us do it his way. Mm. But on this other side, I'm like, God, Give him wisdom. Yes. Give him wisdom. Mm. Let 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 us do the right thing. Mm. You know, and I get so much peace. Mm. And there's sometimes even make that prayer and then he comes and says, You know what, that issue, I think we can do it one, two, three. Mm. And it becomes even better. Mm. I think that would yeah. best way to explain yeah. is yeah. when we say that God created man mm -hmm. in his image. Mm. And we always say that they were created mm. together. Mm. Now you realize if you're created together, mm -hmm. I mean like equal mm -hmm. You both have the ability to hear God. Mm. The only thing we are saying here, viewers, is that the wife knows that for us to go where we are going, I need to submit. But my submission doesn't mean I'm deaf mm. to the voice of yes. God. Mm. And that's why, like what Zilani is saying, he's coming to a place where, yes, I have seen something in God. And it doesn't mean we are not perfect. Mm -hmm. We are in prog uh, we progress. Are in yes. Progress, yes, we are improving every mm -hmm. day. Mm -hmm. And he might see something mm -hmm. that maybe is... Uh, one, one degree off. Mm. And that's what you're saying. Mm. I see something and I know this is the right thing. Mm. But I think I love what she has said that. Mm. I won't fight it. Mm. I go to God. Mm. But I, I must pray. say, it's, mm -hmm. work, it's been working in progress. Oh, yes. You know, mm -hmm. there's a point I'll be like, eh. You refuse. I refuse. Like, outright. Yeah. <laughs> but at least where I am right yeah. now, I, I can peacefully say, you know what? God just... Give him speak wisdom. Speak to the father. Yeah, speak, speak to my husband. Yeah. Speak to him. Mm. Let it be clear what we need to do yeah. so that we can also have that oneness. Mm. And of course, with the oneness, God, God is with us. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So it's been a journey. Sometimes where the conflict comes from. Yes. And then to, to put this in perspective, yeah. like you said, that sometimes mm. you feel this won't work. Yeah. Now, 
let me explain something to the viewers. Mm -hmm. It works this way. Mm -hmm. It's like we are two people. Mm -hmm. My wife has cooked a meal. Mm -hmm. She wants to bring it to the table. Mm -hmm. My job is to bring the table. Yeah. <laughs> okay? Mm -hmm. So, I tell her, you bring the meal, but there is no table. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So, it's not that she's instructing me on mine. Mm -hmm. It is she can see where hers won't fit. Mm -hmm. I can tell there's nowhere to place this. Mm -hmm. Yes. Mm -hmm. So, it's yeah. not her taking my place mm -hmm. and telling me mm -hmm. what you're doing is wrong. Mm -hmm. To get into learning perspective. Mm -hmm. It says, I can see where I'm supposed to flow with this. I'm the womb, but I see no seed. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So when I'm querying you, I'm not telling you what happens. I'm telling God. And then when you come, like you said, mm -hmm. when he brings the idea after hearing God, it's even better. Mm -hmm. Now you see where it fits. Mm -hmm. So God still won't make us crisscross. Mm -hmm. Yes. Where I will go into what you're good at mm -hmm. and what I'm good at. Now, once couples learn that, it changes everything. Mm -hmm. It changes everything in this context. I have capacity to get resource, to buy ingredients. Mm -hmm. My wife loves baking. Mm -hmm. I can buy all the ingredients. Mm -hmm. But I have no clue <laughs> how to bake. And this is a well-known story. <laughs> they are laughing because they know a story. Yes. And I'll tell you the story <laughs> so that you can understand where we are going with this. <laughs> See, that's now help me. Mm -hmm. I have the resources. I can buy everything. Yeah. But I was not equipped or trained if I had wanted to know how to bake in that area, she would have to lead. Mm -hmm. I would have to go and learn from her. Mm. But it's not my natural. It wasn't my ease. For her, it's easy. Yeah. So one day I decided I can bake. To surprise. You see, there's a big difference between deciding <laughs> and being. <laughs> so because I decided I can bake, it was a very good idea. I knew all the things that I normally bought after all who buys. Yeah. Yes. Hey, I know yeah. the list. Yeah. <laughs> I even know how it's broken down. So I got everything. I was alone at home. They had gone out with the, the family. And so I did my business. Mm. I put together pieces. I put everything. I put everything. I put everything. I put it in the oven. I even know the time. Mm -hmm. And I took it out. So when she came home, I was very proud. I had baked. Yes. There's only one problem number one. How big, how many kilos was the cake? <laughs> It was a whole kg. <laughs> <laughs> All right. She tested Sorry, and because she's a wise, she two was two kgs. kgs yes. right? Because she's a wise woman, she said, you missed out something. In other words, in simple terms, <laughs> this is a bad cake. Yeah. <laughs> that's that's we to said nicely. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's 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 to look for the nice wise how woman. To say it, yes. So I said, okay, so what do you think? She said, well, um, it's okay. And I know my wife, when she says something is okay, because she's a perfectionist, something is wrong. Mm. So I decided, okay, this cake, ah, what? You people are refusing to eat my cake. I cut a piece and offered it to my dog. <laughs> the dog smelt it, put its tail between its tail, <laughs> and went out. <laughs> Even the dog refused to eat my cake. <laughs> Proof that there's something wrong with the process. Yeah. Yeah. Did I have all the ingredients? You yes. did. Yes. Did I yes. have all the resources? Yes. yes. <laughs> so the idea... Ladies and gentlemen, they are, the fact that a woman can do or has the resources of being a man doesn't make her one. Mm. Or vice mm. versa. Yeah. That's a lesson. The mm. lesson is, for me to have done the cake right, even though I could bring every precise resource, mm. I needed her input. Mm. It's the same way like Dilani said, even though when I look at this situation, I'm feeling A, B, and B should be done, but if I do it, my doing it violates it. Mm-hmm. That's the way God designed it. Yeah. Knowing and doing are not necessarily the same thing. Mm. In other words, let me explain one of the sad things in the Bible to put this in emphasis. A prophet is late. Yeah. His name is Samuel. Mm. Mm. Because he's late, King Saul decides we can't go to war without a sacrifice. Mm. What he doesn't understand is that it's not that we can't go to war without a sacrifice. Yes. Only Samuel is authorized to make that sacrifice. To make the sacrifice. Mm. Even though all the ingredients are there. Oh, yes. The fire is there. The time is right. Mm. Everything. So what does Saul do? Saul chooses to sacrifice on Samuel's behalf. Mm. Mm. He violates functionality. Yes. He's a king. His job is to go to war. Mm. He wants to go to war. Mm. But Paul, uh, Samuel has delayed. Mm -hmm. So he decides, what? Sits to ginger. Yeah. Mm. Cut the head of this thing, mm. put it on the fire. It's a sacrifice. Mm. Yes, it's a sacrifice. Mm. 
you're not authorized. You're not. Wow. What happens because of that? Not because of the crazy things he had done, and mm. he had done many. Mm. Yes. Because of that, God says, today, your kingdom is taken from you. Wow. And so, wow. And so what I'm... Mistiming. Wow. Yeah. And yeah. So what I'm getting mm -hmm. from that is when you violate the function mm -hmm. in your marriage, mm -hmm. then it's... Then there's your no Your authority blessing. is taken. Yeah. Mm. Your capacity to function is taken uh, away. Mm. Mm. So, ideally, like... Him being the head, I can't now start saying I'm the head. It yes, can, it can't work. You, the minute, yeah. Listen, Saul is a king. Yes, that is his function. Mm -hmm. The minute he tries to become the prophet, mm. he violates He's, function. Mm. Yeah, doomed. He can do it. By the way, he sacrificed. Mm. It wasn't lack he of ability. Did. Mm. Yeah, he did a complete job, mm. and he did it exactly the way, the way, way it is done. normally done. Yeah, it mm. was still a violation. Mm. So what I'm hearing you say is, in the kingdom, yes. there is order. Yes. And functionality. Yes. Okay. Yes. So as the wife, when mm -hmm. you come to a place of understanding, what is my place in the marriage? Mm -hmm. And I always repeat this, that when we talk of place in marriage, there are many women out there who feel like, okay, are you trying to tell me that uh, I cannot do this? And God says, yes. Actually, yes. That's what you're trying to say. <laughs> 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 that's what you're trying to say. Yes. Why? Mm -hmm. Because if you realize that your marriage is a picture of Christ and the church, it's like now putting the church in place and asking Jesus, so you think I cannot do this? Mm -hmm. So you think I cannot give myself instructions? Mm -hmm. So you think I can also no, uh, not take your place? If you put it that way, you understand... Oh, Easy. Mm -hmm. I understand what you're saying. Mm -hmm. That woman is a type of the church. Yes. So if the church cannot go against Christ, mm -hmm. what makes us think the wife can go against the husband mm -hmm. if you want to be an accurate uh, picture? Mm -hmm. And of course, as we go <coughs> along with this, I would like us to take our parting shot. Yes. This is an interesting discussion. Mm -hmm. cannot end in one session. Mm -hmm. But uh, I think uh, the viewers have gotten the gist of what we're trying to yes. say. Mm -hmm. And maybe we can just take our parting shots. Well, for me, I think uh, what I'd say is just strive to have uh, progress, not necessarily perfection. Mm -hmm. Whatever you learn or whatever I learn, I just take one principle, apply it. It doesn't yes. have to be perfect. Mm. If I do it well today, tomorrow not so well, but eventually I, ca I catch the, the, the gist of it, then, yes. then that's, a, that's awesome. Mm. Yeah. 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 For me, love is a decision that I have to be intentional to, to do. Mm -hmm. And uh, you know, love is not a feeling. It is, you know, being patient, being kind, mm -hmm. not keeping a record of wrongs and mm -hmm. all that that, you know, the Bible quotes in Corinthians. Mm -hmm. And uh, and so that's what, mm -hmm. you know, as men, we should do when it comes to loving our wives. Yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. But in short, the Bible says that God sees us through Christ. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That to be like him. That's what we're going at. So for God to see us properly, he sees us through Christ. Mm -hmm. It also means in the marriage, God sees you, wife, through the husband. Mm. It's a picture. Mm. Yeah. When that picture is distorted, mm. the devil has access. Mm. Wow. wow. That's what the devil wants. The mm. devil just looks. If he sees a space, it is his. Mm. If he sees one, he backs off. Mm. Wow. wow. Couples, we are talking about progress not perfection so god is not coming into your marriage and saying i'm looking for perfection he's looking for progress today you do one thing tomorrow you do something else and as we go along you learn to hear his voice over and over and like eric said the mulattis love this statement that to be intentional and deliberate in everything that we do mm -hmm. so as we go along in our marriages let's come to a place of saying you know what god it's about progress and you can see progress in our marriages two as one couples my name is susan opio stay tuned